Hi everybody. Um, it's been a while. I'm still Kirk. Um, I haven't made a video in a while, but oh well, I'm back because I finally got my camera back. Yeah. But um, as you can see by my Zen setup, um, I want to talk about anxiety. Yay, anxiety. No, but more so, um, dealing with anxiety, specifically my anxiety. Because who else's anxiety am I going to deal with? Come on. But um, I have anxiety regularly. Most of it is, you know, anxiety about weird stuff. So I always want to have little things to help me deal with it. And um, I did a video a while back about a fidget cube that I bought. Um, and that really did, uh, I would say it helped. It kind of distracted me. It kind of made me use my hands to distract myself from anxiety, kind of put me in a more peaceful zen uh, place. And I've had that for a while, as you can tell by the older video, um, and I wanted to get a new one. It kind of get, got um, dirty and you know, pieces broke off of it. So I was looking on Amazon to find a new one and there, you know, there's a bunch of new stuff, you know, fidget spinners. There was that whole uh, phase where everybody had a fidget spinner. Um, but I was stuck with the fidget cube. I did get a fidget spinner. And I wanted something new uh, since the craze is gone and there's more easier stuff to find. There's different stuff. So I bought basically a bag of anxiety toys, uh, which is what this is. So let's dig through the bag and see all the stuff I got. Um, the first thing, kind of visual, uh, it's one of these. Does anybody? Only 90s kids remember this. These little things are kind of cool to look at. I remember there was one I always wanted as a kid. It was like wider and there was like all these zigzags and the sh like stream of bubbles would go down it. But this is similar. It looks really cool when there's like a light right behind it. Um, I don't know if this deals with anxiety so much or more it's calming. It's like peaceful and zen and tranquil. You just see water flowing. Water is a very calming presence, especially when it moves slow like that. Um, this is thing. I do like the contrasting green and blue colors. That that is a cool look. This is stuck. That's weird. But uh, put it all to the side. Actually, let's put it up here. So that's the first thing that was in the pack. Um, let's buy anything. This was the next thing. It was a pack of like three of them. This is just like rubber like it's like bendy and stretchy I guess you can like squeeze it and if you're getting really, like really tense and you're stressing out and really anxiety you could like pull this and or you could just like, fling it around this one I don't use too much it just uh, textures I'm really weird with and the texture of this is just kind of it's like stretch arm strong and I never like those so I keep I kept it, but it's not my favorite out of the bag. Um, this is probably my favorite as far as what I use. Um, this one is new. I haven't heard of it. It's called a I think Forever Cube or an, um, Infinity Cube. I don't know, but it's just like a cube, like a Rubik's cube. But if you open it up the right side, it basically keeps going. So you could always just like, it's kind of mindless. Like I do this when I'm like watching TV or something when my hands are free and I'm just kind of distracted. Like this is pretty cool. It goes on forever, forever, forever. So this one is probably my favorite out of the cube, out of the set, um, the little, forever cube this one is new I'm not sure it's like a like a little pea pod I guess you do like this and like oh there's a little face I don't even realize that I just opened it it's like a little face that pops out another face no 
I guess you could like just, this can just be in your pocket and you could just we'll put on your keychain. I kind of like this one now. It's weird. Hey, 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 hey. I'm weird, I know. I kind of like that one. Um, this one is another favorite. Um, I don't know how to describe it, but it's not like the, the rubber thing. It's, um, it's hard and it, you know, goes into a certain shape, but you can kind of mold it. It's like hard clay. If that makes sense. This one, you just like, it's like having string on your finger. Like it's a more durable string, you can say. Um, this one I like too. It's a second to the cube. It was like a three pack of those, which is cool. Um, this is the original reason. This is the fidget cube, like the original fidget cube I had. It's pretty much the same. But all these, these are kind of different. Um, same switch in the this part and the turning of this knob. This is a bit different, um, but it's all the same. This will always be like, to me, the best thing because it has so many different things you could do to just occupy mine and get just get yourself off of you know anxiety for no reason uh, what's next oh another one of these hey. Where's the face? Hey. 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 All right. what's next oh yeah I guess I missed this whole craze. This actually doesn't do anything for anxiety or fidgety, fidgetiness. It just kind of, nobody does it anymore. I still don't keep one. Oh, it's another one of those things. Yeah, it was like a three pack. Let's see. Oh, another rubber thing. This one is pretty nice, but it's weird. There's like a metal ball in this thing. You just move it back and forth. This is a good fidget thing. Like an actual, I don't know if it deals with anxiety, but or stress. You can't, it's a metal ball, so you can't squeeze it, but it's good for like to keep you calm and if you're fidgeting around. It's a good zen thing. This I feel. It's like, it's a little meshy. If you're in the textures. Okay. Uh, this one I never opened. I'm not sure what it is. I don't remember it from like when I bought these. Um, oh, it's pretty cool. It's kind of like the this cube where it goes on. It uh, it's just like two rings and it's like a little rubber part right here. You just keeps going. It's really interesting. Hey, I like this one. It'd be better to do, like you could just do it with one hand, like you could just have it between your fingers, but it can't. It's kind of awkward to do it that way, I guess. Hmm. It's pretty nice though. This is a keeper. It's good to like do this mindlessly and just not think about stuff. Which is what most of these toys do. Which is what exactly what I needed. So I like that one. Um, and this is just another one of those ball sleeve things. Um, the bag is kind of nice, but that's all my little anxiety, fidget, stress things. So thanks for watching. Hope this helps someone. These mostly helped me. So peace. Out, guys.